But yeah, man, y'all see what y'all think. Oh, that looks like a face. Y'all see that? Ah, uh, that's funny. That, that look like a face. We hustle daily. What's going on, you two? Welcome back to another video, man. It's your boy, Big Play Ray, coming to y'all with another auction video, man. It's so cold out here. I got the a glove on. It's, oh, I got a glove on, but it seems like the gloves make your hands colder. Talk about this glove. Um. But we in Cold Park, man, looking for one of these whips. Man, it's so freaking, this walk with these rocks, man, they do not be good. But, man, I'm looking for a Ford Taurus. We're going to get right into what I'm looking for, you know what I'm saying? But if you haven't already, while I look for this, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit the notification bell, man. Make sure you follow your boy on the gram we hustle daily dot c o make sure you go to whdacademy.com i thought that was a srtg make sure you go to whdacademy.com because that's where you're gonna learn how to check out cars pick out cars at the auction i'm gonna show you everything i know so make sure you check out the web sizzle my nizzle for shizzle for rizzle all right so we're looking for a ford tourist we're going get right into it man but it seems like i'm having to walk all the way to the back man all the way to the back to find this car it's crazy right now but man i appreciate y'all oh man these rocks bro oh my gosh but i appreciate y'all man who continue to tune in continue to rock with me man so let me find this car and um we're gonna get right into it man i had to walk all the way to the back to find this car. All the way to the back. All the way to the very, very back. Man, check out the Tesla looking righteous. But let's see. Man, I had to walk all the way to the back to find this car. Let's see, man. We gotta see if we got something good though. We got a dent right here. Um. What y'all think? I like these Tauruses because um, they cheap, you know? We're gonna check the Tesla out too. Look at that door panel. That door panel is super clean. <laughs> Look like nobody even pushed the button or touched the latch, nothing. Nobody sit back there, touch that door panel, for real. Back seats look pretty uh, decent. Um, the only thing I see is, you know, a little stain right there. Oh, this joint got power, boy. This joint got some power. So you already know what we about to do, baby. We about to crank this thing straight up. Myself up. <laughs> oh man, I am funny. <laughs> Dang, it's raggedy though. Mm. Nah, I have it to the knob. All oh, the junk stuck. At least turning on this side. But man, it's drinking. Oh, I'm gonna give it some gas. Oh, they're gonna ready, all right. The radio don't go to this car. It definitely doesn't go to this car. Oh, I'm pushing the brake. I'm sure. Push, 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 push. Man, the plan was the rest of plan. See, they got they had a radio in here, so maybe they was gonna put.
put that in. I don't know. Hockey pucks. Let's see no hockey pucks. Oh, hockey puck. Damn. Hockey pucks in a long time. Let's check out the Tesla, even though the Tesla is crashed. I know y'all would probably want to see the Tesla, so I'm going to show you the Tesla. Is this the Tesla? No, that's not the Tesla bumper. That's a white bumper. Oh. There's the back of the damage, Tesla damage right here. Not too bad, though. This Tesla actually may run for you rebuilders out there. What is these? Head tail lights? Yeah, no trunk lights for the trunk. That's what happened to the Tesla right there. Somebody smack the Tesla. I guess I can keep that down though. Keep the water out for whoever is gonna buy this thing. Oh, eight miles. Dang, you say it only got eight miles on this car. That's what this thing says. Let's see if we can get in this thing because you know they be locked up. Like, see, can't even get in there. Sucks, man. But got that that black interior. Plain Jane. It's like an Apple interior. That, that that interior is how the um the Apple Store look. That's what the inside of the Tesla remind me of the Apple Store. Let me know if you agree in the comments below but one car down that was a total fail let's see if we can find something else what's up hustle nation this video has been sponsored to you by whdacademy.com the online course that's going to teach you everything you need to know about the auction game all my tips on how to properly inspect cars and most importantly how to make money as you can see i've been doing this for a while and as you can also see, I have plenty of testimonials on how I've helped others gain success in this business. So if you're interested in learning, be sure to click the link in the description below. All right, I couldn't show y'all in that Tesla, so I figured I'd show y'all. Shit, I can't show y'all in this one either. Just the other one though. Just the big one, the Model S. I like the other one better. But the other one looks like a frog in the front. This one looks like a, like a regular car. What? I want to show y'all this Corvette that I just now seen. Corvette Stingray. I don't think I've showed y'all this before. I think this one is this new. Um, this is a nice little car right here. Well, we're going to look at the whole car first. And then we are going inside. I don't know why they got tape over the um, the front, but it's a nice little car, man. Got the old Chevy badges. 1965 Corvette. 1965 Marauder tires. Dang, got some big vents. Damn. I wish I could look at the motor. 1965. Oh, I guess it's a motor under there. Oh, it is a motor under there. Edel Brock and everything. They just don't want it to get messed up, so. Corvette Stingray. Old school joint right here. Got the pipes coming out the back. Is that the gas tank? Yup. Weird place to put the gas tank. Oh. Let's see. Old school Georgia plate right there. 65 vet. It says. Stick shift. What's that? Fourth gear, yup. 160 on the dash, 58. Thousand miles. I'm pretty sure this thing is not gonna crank up, but we will see. Is the key in here even? No, I did not see the key. There's the ignition, but where's the key? Old school joint, boy. Y'all see it? Damn, it's not even back there. Wait a minute, this top come off? Oh, the top. Hold up, the top. Yo, the top come off this joint, okay. 
Oh yeah. Let's see. Did this come up or something? I don't know. What you have, Y'all see what y'all think? Oh, that looks like a face. Y'all see that? Ah, oh, that's funny. That, that look like a face. I wonder if they made that look like that. But yeah, man, y'all see it. But this top come straight off. Yup, sure do. Let the top off on you. Smooth. This is a nice car right here. What's this for the window to go this way? I don't want to poke. Let me see. Oh, yeah. Tilt the window right there. Damn, this is kind of hard, though. And then this one for the glass, okay. What's this? Lock and unlock? What y'all think, though? I think it looks pretty cool for the old school 65, 65 vet. Y'all see the license plate. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this thing in the comments below. Alrighty. Man, I've been doing so much walking. It's ridiculous. So, we got the Chevrolet S10. These trucks um, definitely be holding their value sometimes. It's got another one. We got another one at co parties. I should, well, I didn't even, no, I couldn't find it, the other one. But they got another co part uh, one right now that's super high, the ATT one that I was looking at. Hopefully, this thing got some power, man. Clean. You got the little back seat right here. I don't see no, well, it ain't no lights for it to come on. I don't see no lights down here, so. I don't know, let's see. Let's go on the other side. They got the zip ties hanging up on the bumper. Okay, I see you, partner. All right. It's a 2000 model, by the way. I think some people say that these transmissions be messing up. I, ain't, I haven't had one of these before, so I don't know too much about this one. Uh, uh, the Vortec, you know. I even want to sit in here. Oh, oh yeah. Power, baby. Yeah, okay, okay. My may have found one. 134,000 miles, good miles on it. Okay, okay, okay. Oil pressure is... Right there, 60. This thing, yeah, it's supposed to open. It's broke, but I thought it was a. Uh, let me see. There's no door to open this. That's the only door that opens this. Okay. Yo, is that a damn pee bottle? I think it is, dude. That's a damn pee bottle, y'all. Seem bad, 134,000 miles. Good miles on it. Oh man, hold up. I smell something. I feel like my nose is running. Oh. Oh shit! I almost dropped the damn thing. Thought I smell some burning. So this is the four cylinder one. So this one might be good as far as the transmission. I think the vortex be slipping, but this one seeming all right right now. Oh man, we're gonna have to check this out. Oh, 
this what I smell? I smell something, y'all. But here's the bed. It smells like something burning or something. I don't know. It's a nice truck, though. So let me check this truck out. Let me get inside this thing and check this thing out, man. Because... Let me check that glove box too. Because y'all know sometimes the roaches like to pop out. I don't see nothing. I don't see nothing. Bet. Alright, so we got the ABS light, we got the brake light on. Let me release that brake. Bow. Let's make sure the brakes is good. Hold on. We got some room back there, yep. Sound kind of funny. I put it in dry just a little bit. A little funny. It'd be hard to like really test drive the car on these rocks, yo. Uh oh. Put that thing in reverse, and this is sound like you didn't want to cut off. And I still smell that burning noise. Me smell. Go up. It definitely doesn't have that uh full that that Vortech B 4.3 guy. See? Damn they wanna cut off. What's that about? So you already know y'all. We ain't about to mess with this. Damn, I even drive it. There's something going on with this one, y'all. And I still smell that burning noise. Like it's, it's... Oh, I think the transmission is burning out. Yeah. That's why I say, man. Definitely, definitely, definitely have to test these cars out. Because as you can see, like... Something's going on. And I was just talking about the transmission, too. See what I mean? So, yep. Got to know about these cars a little bit, man, to, you know, really check these things out. With every, every time I see one of these, they don't be too good. But let me look on the list, see if I can find anything else. They got a Nissan exterior, but I really don't even want to check out that exterior because it's an exterior. I don't like the exteriors, the Pathfinders, those Nissan. Shoot, Nissan just been, they've been tripping, man. So, so uh let me see if i can find anything else on my list i mean I also got a honda core but i've been doing so much freaking walking today that i don't even know if i want to look for that because those got transmission problems as well it's a 1999 or 2000 the little four-door civic like you've seen in uh tyrese was driving in baby uh, baby boy yeah that one transmission problems v6s four cylinders they all got transmission problems i got a homie who liked to buy the four cylinder but Man, everyone I done bought of those be messed up. So let me look on my list and I'll get back to y'all in one second. All right. Oh, let's check out this big boy truck. Do y'all like these trucks? Let me know. These are some more trucks that even with a whole lot of miles, they, uh, you know, you still gonna pay. They definitely are nice, though. Oh. Yeah, big wheels on these things. These tires are humongous. 22s. That's what she said. Ooh, it's stinking here, though. This smell like water in this joint, man. I always like looking in here. I'm looking, looking through stuff. I'm just a nosy. Nosy rosy. Let's see what we got. We got some soup. Boom. I was just, hey, didn't I just say something about baby boy? I just said something about that, y'all. So we got baby boy boys in the hood. Sandlot. The sandlot. I ain't heard of that one. Oh, yeah. Some type of electric air pump. 
Was this small? I know this ain't no super small air pump. Let's see. Oh, it's just a cord. But yeah, man. Um, Y'all see what's going on. 5.6 V8. Let's see if this thing's gonna crank up. Oh, man. Oh, it did not crank up, y'all. But what y'all think about this truck, though? Um, what y'all think, man? Got the heated seats, all of that. You got a roof too now. I don't think it ain't got the roof. Um, I'm curious to see what this is. Damn, it's like a big old storage box in there. But yeah, man, this truck definitely smells like water or something. Um, yeah, so don't crank up, guys. So got to keep it moving. But y'all let me know if y'all think this is a nice truck. Let me know in the comments below. All right, the, wet, uh, the red wheels caught my attention, but dang, the front messed up. I like white with the red wheels and I like black with the red wheels. You can't go wrong. Oh, the interior's messed up though. Oh man, we got the coppers over here. 325i. Yeah, man, so. All right, Hustle Nation, man. I'm not about to look for that exterior or that Honda Accord. You know, I've been walking around this thing all day. My feet hurt on these damn rocks, you know. So make sure y'all go to whdacademy.com, man. Y'all want to learn how to check out cars, man. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up for this video because, uh, man, I've been walking and walking and walking. And, and, and to look for that exterior in that Honda Accord, I don't even think it's worth it because... I don't even like exteriors or Honda Accords. And my hand is freezing in this glove. So shout out to the whole hustle nation. Appreciate y'all tuning in. It's your boy Ray. Big play Ray, I'm gone.